Alrighty guys, what is going on? I'm Tubby Emu, and you guys are absolutely epic. Um, absolutely killing it on these GM mode videos, and it just goes to show that I'm going to keep doing these. You know, I'm getting comments like, you have more likes than views, and then somebody goes, Super HD Og 11 goes, that's because YouTube can't count. What? Most trying to make this the most interactive GM mode. Tubby, tubby Maniacs be running wild on you, brother. From Daniel U5613. I hope I'm reading these right. I'm kind of looking at him weird. And uh, too slow for the hoe says, keep them coming, Tubby. I really enjoy them. Um, Cabin. Cabin. Or Cabon. Something like that. This is awesome. And then it comes down to the suggestion for the match cards. And somebody said, French Kiss said, I'm glad you're cheating. It's the only way to pass GM mode, so don't feel bad. So I'm not going to feel bad for trading for John Cena, Shawn Michaels, and Triple H. And chances are, somebody had said to trade MVP for other superstars. And I probably will end up doing that. Um, I don't want to make their popularity too high. That's one of the suggestions from some people. You said if you raise the popularity... You also get more views, but the problem with that is it also um, you have to pay a lot more money to have them. Uh, so it's not cheating. We're using the glitches in the system. So the honorable mention for the match card for Backlash as we take a look. We are at the Backlash pay per view. The honorable mention for the Backlash card from I'm Andar Six. It had 26 thumbs up. Was CM Punk versus Edge special guest referee. Can't do it. There is no special guest referee in this. Michelle McCool versus Molina versus Tori Wilson. You guys can see the rest of the, the match card on there. That is the honorable mention. But the most thumbs up comments was Backlash DX versus the Hardy Boys in a Hell in a Cell Tornado Tag. John Cena versus Randy Orton and CM Punk versus Edge in a special guest referee match. Now, unfortunately, I don't think for the main event that I can do that. Let's see. I'm pretty sure you can't. One on two. No, you're not able to do that, unfortunately. It was 2007. It was the last year there was a special guest referee match. So, instead, I think we we had another comment, and I'm not sure which one it is, to have a TLC match for the title at Backlash between Edge and his contender, CM Punk. So, uh-oh. He is not in contention. Guys, what what does that mean? He's not in contention. Who gets the title opportunity? Well, after picking up two victories, this is going to come as a surprise to some people. Kane is getting the title opportunity. Yes, in fact, it is Kane versus Edge in a TLC match. And we're, we are doing that because, you know, Kane did put over two big matches. And then let's take a look. What match do we want to make next? Let's make the World Tag Team title match. It is a two-on-two. -two, um, Hell in a Cell Tornado Tag. Thanks to Mr. Lapalin. Between Jeff Hardy and Matt Hardy. Taking on Shawn Michaels and Triple H. Um, some people were talking about, you know, um, that if I play... I'm automatically going to win. That's not always going to be the case, guys. Trust me. Um, but the, the the it's so bad in this game. The lack of um, uh, what do I want to say? Uh, triple threat for the Divas title. Um, it's just so bad between um, Michelle McCool as the Divas champion, and we have Tori Wilson earned her shot two times, both times against my odds, and then going up against Kelly Kelly. Um, I'm just, I just I can't do that, you know. It it's, you know, sounds stupid, but that's just the way things are gonna have to go. And then a one on one match between uh, John Cena, and let's make that. Um, let's make that one. We can't do a, a steel cage because there's already a hell in a cell. Let's just make that a hardcore match between John Cena versus Randy Orton. Okay. And then we have a triple threat. Uh, let's go a table triple threat between MVP. 
um, Johnny Nitro. And we traded Umaga, so unfortunately Umaga is no longer here. And let's also include... Actually, I don't think we have anybody else we can include, unfortunately. Ah, oh, shoot. Kane's already in a match. Um, so it looks like, unfortunately, we're not going to be able to do that. Wow, what the hell? I didn't even think about that. Well, here, why don't we do... No, we can't put in a manager. Let's do a one-on-one. -on -one. One on two, hardcore single, and we'll give a manager. We'll give her, um, can't even have a manager as a girl if it's not a regular match. Wow, that is horrible. Well, let's do a one-on-one -on -one first blood match between Johnny Nitro and MVP at Backlash. Looks like we got a pretty good match card right now. Um, we don't have the Intercontinental title on the, on the line, so let's go ahead and put that. I don't think we have one so far. Uh, current champions. Let's give it to it's MVP or Johnny Nitro. Well, it's a toss up. So I'm just going to flip a coin. I don't have a coin, but we're going to go to Johnny Nitro and his first title opportunity. I guess we could have just had it. You know what we could do? Let us just do it like this. Um, can't be vacated, unfortunately. All right, well, there we go. We pretty much have the card set up, but this will be for the title. It'll be for the Intercontinental title, and it'll be a one-on-one. -on -one. Let's see. First blood match? Yes. All right, so here is our card. Chauncey versus Randy Orton in a hardcore single. The Women's Triple Threat Divas title match. A Hell in a Cell tornado tag and a TLC for the title. Let's confirm. And guess what, guys? We are going to play... Every single one of them. So let's go. Any mini mini mo catch tag about the let's pick. Oh, it went CPU. Let's let it go CPU then. We'll just let the CPU play. We'll talk and we'll go over a couple different things. Uh, first of all, I want to say thank you guys for all the support. If you enjoy the video, please leave a like. Let's get to the last one. I keep saying 500, but the first one was at like 580. Second one's over 600. Third one's uh, at 800. The fourth one hit 500 in less than three hours. I mean, come on, three hours, guys, for 500 likes? That is unheard of on my channel ever. I'm actually a little nervous, to be honest with you. All right, who do we got here? We actually know who it is. It is Johnny Nitro. So it's the first blood, so we'll just chill back. We'll wait. We'll watch the match, and then we'll decide which match we're actually going to play in. We may play in more than one. I have not yet decided, because this video is probably going to go on quite a bit. Johnny Nitro, MVP, ball and status. Here we go. What are they doing? They're both just chilling. Chilling like a villain. Now, I, I was getting some, you know, requests, you know, people talking about, you know, doing WWE 12. I think for right now, I'm going to hold off from doing GM mode in universe mode. Uh, ju just for now. Um, this one is going over so well. And most of the comments are enjoying GM mode. So until things like start to drop off, I'm going to stay in 08. Uh, this is SVR 2008, if you guys are wondering. Some people have been like, Toby, what are you playing? And I'm like, I'm playing 08. Um, you may be looking at it and seeing like, Toby, some of it looks good. You know, the GM mode's awesome. What do you think of it? Uh, the GM mode is broken. Um, and before I would get so you know mad about playing it. But nowadays, I'm just having fun playing it. It's something unique. It's something cool um, that a, a lot of the games, you know, don't have now because they have the road to WrestleMania. And a lot of people are still huge fans of it. I think, you know, the Superstar Mode 24-7 for, you know, a GM, you know, has a lot of stuff it needs to improve on. But at the same time, the Superstar Mode 24-7, well, you can play one full year. Um, it is lacking because, you know, once it starts over, it just, you know, relapses the same thing. You get the same repeating storyline, kind of like if you had a year two of Wrestlemania road to Wrestlemania I want to say uh, what are you doing MVP big swinging neck breaker from MVT P, MV, MVT 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 that, that's what I want to call him MVT ah both of these guys you have the shaman the sexy MV, why are you spamming the same moves he keeps doing the same you think you would learn MVP what are you doing Johnny Nitro showing why he is the current Intercontinental Champion. 
And some of you may be wondering, somebody, how did Johnny Nitro get the title? Um, I was actually kind of glad. A couple of people noticed what happened. Um, I built up Umaga for the title, and I gave it to him, and he was going to originally face Kane for it, but then I traded Umaga to get, who was it that I traded him for? I think DX, and then I no longer had Umaga. Beat the shit out of each other. Into the pole, uh-oh. Oh, guys, his head is yellow. This could be a problem. Johnny Nitro is getting beat to shit by MVP on the outside right now. Into it again. Yellow head. This could almost be it. I could see blood start to spew very closely. As MVP's got the upper hand on Johnny Nitro right now for the vacant title. I mean, I guess I could have just had a match and then gave him a title. I didn't. I didn't guess I didn't even think about that. Was just, that was one of the suggestions, I think, was tell you, Tubby. Just, uh, you know, have a match and then give him the title. Wow. I actually feel like an idiot now. Get him, Johnny. Hurricane Rana? That's not a Hurricane Rana. God, I can't even remember what that is. Backlash. A lot of people, you know, wanted... I think in the comments of my old videos, they wanted Backlash back. Me, personally, I never was a huge fan of the Backlash pay-per-view. Maybe that's just me. MVP trying to get the upper hand. Johnny Nitro fighting back. Uh-oh. It's choking him. Yeah, yeah, MVP. Bitch slapping his chest right now. MVP's got the upper hand. Johnny Nitro's looking to be hurt, guys. MVP, how many times are you going to hit him? Just get a chair and beat him down. Psh. He's like, I'm done. MVP's got a finisher, guys. Is he going to use it? No, he stores it. Johnny Nitro fighting back a little bit right now. Going into a lockup. Oh, to the back of the head. I don't think his cornrows are going to allow him to bleed, though. That's not That's not going to be a good thing. What are you doing, Johnny? What are you doing? Oh, he misses. He reverses it. <laughs> I like how he does nothing. The, the AI doesn't even capitalize on it. And it's just on regular. I don't know what difficulty it's on. I don't mind playing on a harder difficulty, but the problem was, you know, so many reversals and things like that. Especially in older games, there's a lot of problem. MVP, why are you doing the move? Oh, shit. He didn't reverse it for the first time. Uh-oh. He reversed it again with a neck breaker. Look at this. This is kind of being a good match right now. Yeah, both of these guys are going to town on each other. Who is going to pick up the title? The Intercontinental title is on the line right now. One of these guys is going to get traded away for some better talent, so you're going to have to, you know, have to watch and decide who you think. Leave it in the comment section below, guys. Who do you think out of these two I should build up fan popularity? Who should I trade away, MVP or Johnny Nitro? I think it'll be interesting to see, you know, what's going to happen. Big GDT, he's got an orange head. He's getting ready to bleed. MVP's got the upper hand. Can he finish him off right here? Oh, he runs him down, barricades. MVP going top rope. Uh-oh. Big elbow from the top rope. Johnny Nitro's now orange in the chest and orange in the head. Is he about to turn red in the face? Is MVP celebrating a little bit here with the big pump, big elbow. MVP's got a finisher. Is he going to store it or is he going to use it? Kicking him in the groin area. Oh, Johnny Nitro is done for. He's got to be done for. He's orange. He's yellow. A kick to the face. Bleeding is imminent. It is almost here. Johnny trying to make somewhat of a comeback. Huge Hurricane Rana. Hurricane Rana. Johnny Nitro's got the upper hand. Go for a weapon, Johnny. What are you doing? All it would take right now is a weapon, and you could come back. What's he doing? He's going to Irish whip him into the corner. Johnny, get him. Attack him. There we go. There we go. We got a little bit of fight back. So now MVP has got a yellow head, orange body. Johnny Nitro is orange, orange, yellow. So MVP right now currently has the upper hand. This could be this could be it almost. Collar and tie lockups right now. MVP going for a submission move. It's not it's not a submission match though, guys. It's not gonna do anything. Wrench it in, MVP. You can't get him to bleed from choking him. Double drop kick. What the hell? Oh, they double drop kicked and failed. 
and they both immediately stood up. Talk about issues with the game. Johnny Nitro fighting back, going top rope. Big drop kick. MVP is now red. He's the first player to be red. MVP's got a yellow head, a red body. Will we get to see blood underneath the body? Oh, shit. Johnny Nitro. He's got a finisher. Big elbow to the head. Look, Is MVP bleeding? Is he bleeding? No, he's not bleeding. He's coming back. Both of these guys have went through hell. Their bodies are just sore. They're beat down. I actually want to see what's going to happen now in the CPU versus CPU match that people were requesting. MVP is red. These guys are giving it their all right now. Going out, putting on a first star match. Not a first star match, a first match quality. Johnny is just getting beat down before, and it seems like he's got the upper hand right now. MVP is just not able to find anything. He counters. they got to go for a weapon. I think one weapon shot from either one of these guys and this match would be over. You can only get so red. Big drop kick to the back. You're not going to make your opponent bleed in the back, though, guys. Come on. You got to go for those headshots. Is he going to reverse the DDT? Johnny's trying to get out of it. MVP just lets go of the hold. Both of these guys, you can see how hurt they are. A spear! A spear! Red, orange, red, yellow. Sounds like the state of our economy. Look at it. MVP's got a finisher. Is he going to use it right here? Another spear to the body. MVP stores his finisher. He's going up top again. Is he going for the big elbow drop? Uh Uh-oh, he hears it. Another bit. Oh, no. He reverses it. Oh, jeez. Okay, these guys right now. You know, some people were complaining about CPU matches. This is a good match right now. They're going back and forth. I don't even know who's going to win right now. I'm just sitting back in my chair, enjoying, relaxing, watching this pay-per-view. Kind of like a fan. I think I might have paid to see money to see this in this first blood match. Really, all they have to do, though, is get a weapon. One bell shot, one chair shot, and this thing could be over as MVP's got another finisher. He stores one. He's got one picked up. Into the corner, hits his head. Johnny Nitro has got a red head, red body, yellow legs. No, what are you doing, MVP? Don't go up top again. Don't go up top again. Just hit his head. Hits him again with another elbow drop, a finisher. What is MVP going to do? You can't choke him out. This isn't a submission match, MVP. He could tap and it wouldn't matter. Make him tap. Wrench it in. Wrench it in. Oh, God, Johnny Nitro's trying to fight back. An opening contest, this is actually, I was, I was a bit surprised, you know. I don't know if we're going to see blood. It could take a while. It's on one of these guys' blades a little bit. Who's going to be the first one? Look at Johnny. Johnny is just out of it. Absolutely red. MVP trying to fight back. Another big drop kick to the body. I'm nervous, guys. I am nervous. They're both red. They're both beat down. At least this one doesn't have stamina because I know if it was 07 that was doing CPU, they'd have to sit there (laughs) refreshing their body. MVP looks to be a little bit more hurt. Red body, red head. Almost a red head. Going for a... Actually, neither one of them are fire crotch. If you guys get that reference. Oh, a spear. A spear. Come on, he's got a red head. Don't go up top again. Just hit him in the head. Come on, MVP. You can do this. Another big elbow drop to the chest. He's got a finisher. Just one DDT. Do something, MVP. Oh, shit. None of these moves are going to make him bleed, MVP. You got to make him bleed. You can go after the legs all you want. Got red, red, yellow. MVP is clearly dominating this match. Johnny Nitro was hurt. He's just spamming these moves now. He's being a noob. I don't think we're going to do CPU versus CPU anymore as it goes up top. Oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. One of them has just got to go for a finisher. One of them has got to hit the finisher. Hit him in the head with something. MVP, stop going up top. What is he? You're balling, I know, but that's not going to finish him off. He's already, oh, Johnny Nitro reverses it. Come on, Johnny. Let's see. Can I play this in any way? 
Is there anything I can do to, to get a match? To join it? I wish there was. Because I would totally just come in right now. And just dominate. There's nothing I can do? Shit. I want to play. I want to get in there and finish him off. One ring bell to the head from either one of these guys. And they are done with. Yes, kick him in the face. Oh, big punches. These guys are fighting back. Both giving it everything they've got. And he's he's going up top again. <laughs> MVP, what are you doing? Another elbow. That's got to be like his 10th elbow drop in this game alone. Beat him down. Yes, yes, that's blood. That is blood. Guys, MVP is your new intercontinental champion at the Backlash pay-per-view. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. I, I'm in awe right now. What a match these two put on. He's already got the belt on. Oh wow. Maybe we should have gave the belt to MVP in the first place. MVP after a grueling 15 minute match. These guys put their bodies on the line last minute going for the title. And MVP came out victorious. Look at that celebration. You go to town MVP. You deserved every single minute of that. As John Morrison is just bleeding. Beat to hell. That finishes it up, guys. Wow. I'm I'm a little nervous right there. I was a bit skeptical on what was going to happen there. Oh, jeez. I'm, I'm kind of shaking in my boots right now, guys. All right, so that match went on a really, really long time. Let us play John Cena versus Randy Orton. We're going to play it. And I'm going to be any mini money mo catch talking about it. Tell me the hours I'm going to go. My mother told me never to stop. And I say blah, 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 blah. Hey, we are playing as John Cena in a hardcore match versus Randy Orton. Now, Randy Orton is hurt, guys. He was bloodied. He was battered. He was put through a car. Absolutely beat to shit in the parking lot brawl last week. So you know he's not going to be 100%. He may look like he's 100%, but I think it's a hardcore match. If I can go out there, get some weapons, and finish him off, I could take down Randy Orton. This is kind of like for the face of WWE right now. Because some people are saying, Tubby, how dare you put Randy Orton on the top? What the hell? And they, they were legitimately getting mad at me. So this could be our chance to take down the big man. I'm, I'm really interested to see what will happen. All right, did you know the Heartbreak Kid? Yes, I did. All right, Cena. How many attitude adjustments will it take today? Get out of there. Where are you going, Randy? Are you coming back in with a chair too, Randy? Oh, to the face! You guys, look at this. Do I already have a finisher after three chair hits? Oh, my God. We already, how do we already have a finisher? No, he reverses my finisher, guys. I built up a finisher super fast. Another chair shot to the head. See, guys, the reason we're doing this, now I normally wouldn't do this because it seems kind of cheap and, you know, unfair, but Randy Orton is hurt. Kane brought it to him in that parking lot brawl, and what you didn't know is John Cena, they're actually working for each other. They're going to potentially partner up. I might, I might make them a tag team. Oh, God, what are you doing? Come on, John. Take him down. Ah, oh, modified side slam right there. Hit him with a chair. Does he already have a finisher? He's got a finisher. Attitude adjustment. Attitude adjustment. Quick match at the pay-per-view. Go for that pin. She is done with. She is over. One. Two. Oh, no. Nope. We're not going to let Randy get out of it that easy. He's going to take the punishment in this match. Oh! Bam! Bam! Yeah. I'll show you my hero. John Cena is my number one. My go-to guy. We've got to make it happen. Randy, what are you doing? Oh, God. Get up. Get up, John. The Viper's coming back. Punch to the face. Oh, God. Randy's coming back. Out of nowhere, Randy is beating us down. This is not good for us. Nation, we need your help. Come on. Uh-oh. Back. Oh. Randy does not want to go down. He is not wanting to win right now. Lose. He reverses another one. John Cena, go up top. 
Hit him with a move. Big elbow from the corner. We're not going to spam it. Like, get up. Get up, Randy. You're orange, orange, and yellow. Oh, Randy got it. Oh, no. no. Don't hit me with it. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. He hit me with it. Guys, I don't... <laughs> no, Randy. Randy, you don't need a finisher, sir. Give me that. Oh, we both have finishers. Get up, Randy. Say goodbye, guys. Here it is. Oh, no. What are you doing? Randy, a dirty finisher? Not a low blow. Not a low blow. Oh, my God. He could pick up a victory right now. Is this it, guys? We have to get out of this. You can't get that dirty finisher. Randy, do not win on a dirty finisher, man. What is he, Paul Levesque back in his early days? Oh, shit. So my, I guess my plan of trying to end him really fast is not going to be kosher, guys. Oh, we got to go for a weapon. We need something. Anything under there? A sledgehammer. Oh, no. He's going to use it again? Son of a bitch. He's got a finisher. He's got a finisher. Get up, John. You can't let him use it on you again. Give that to me, bitch. Oh, no. Stop reversing it. He falls. There we go. Punch him down. Beat him down. These two are brawling right now. Absolutely going to town on each other. Yeah, guess what? Sledgehammer, bitch. And guess what that means? Here we go. I'm smelling an attitude adjustment. Oh, shit. Randy Orton reversed it. Randy, what are you doing? Another low blow. No. You can't hit me with a low blow, sir. Guys, I'm not... I'm really nervous right now. He hit me with another low blow. This match is supposed to be over quick. No. No. What? John Cena, the face of the WWE, coming over from ECW in a trade was dominating that whole match, and Randy came back. How, okay, I, I don't even know how I lost right there. I am in complete awe. I have no idea how that just happened. Randy picks up a victory after an attitude adjustment. Numerous chair shots. Is Randy the legend killer? Is this the beginning of a legend killer storyline, guys? He just took down John Cena, who, in my mind, is a legend. I mean, you may not think it, but Randy Orton, I give you props, sir. That was a good match. That was entertaining. Whew. I'm nervous now, guys. I, I don't know what's going to happen. Anything can go down now. The fact that he beat us. All right. So I, I feel like these two matches are going to be a long time. So let's do one more. Let us play. And I am going to be... Any mini my mo to talk about it tell if y'all let him go. My mother told me to be the best one and stop. I'm gonna be Michelle McCool. That's any mini mighty mo picked it. Do I even know any mini mighty mo anymore? I don't even think I do. Rick Rude. Oh, that was another suggestion you guys were talking about. Tubby, get legends, get legends. I I know they're there, but I actually have to go back and like do challenges and get money. And to do that you have to go into Superstar twenty four seven if you want super fast cash. And basically just simulate through a year and win your WrestleMania match. The problem with that, though, guys, is one, it takes forever. And two, if I'm already doing a GM mode, I can't just switch into a 24-7 player mode. So trust me, guys. I am working on it. All right, here we go. Ashley, god damn, I want some of her. Playboy cover girl, uh-huh. I want to break me off a piece of that Kit Kat. Definitely got that Playboy tat on her. All right, Michelle McCool. All right, triple threat. There's no DQ, so is there anything under the ring? Oh, get up. Three hotties. Hotties with the bodies. What? Wait, What? There's no DQs in triple threat matches ever. Because you can't crown a winner. Ex oh, what the hell just happened? 
I guys, I have no idea what just happened right there. Leave it in the comment section below, guys. Let's get 500 likes again. These last two matches, we'll do in another video because we're already at 30 minutes. We'll get another one. Guys, I'm Toby Emu. Thank you for joining me. I'm nervous. I, I don't know how the hell that just happened. Let me know, guys. Are Divas not allowed to do hardcore matches? Tubby out.